To one of Tokyo's many public bathhouses called Sento. They're usually very distinctive looking buildings around neighborhoods with high chimneys. We're going to get naked and show you what makes Tokyo's bathhouses worth a visit. Tokyo Sentos all have the same price, but they're certainly all different and unique. As the industry changes from the past to the future, it's an exciting time right now to take a bath in Tokyo. Welcome to Takarayu. This is one of Tokyo's most famous sentos, sento being a public bathhouse. Takarayu is famous for kind of maintaining that retro style that they had decades and decades ago. But that's not the only attraction. Of course, they are the baths. And to help me explain it all is a sento master, Machida-san. I think he's just arrived. Hi. まあ、初めてじゃないでしょ。え、もう何百回。これは大体すごい。え、この建物いつ作りました。え、大体80年ぐらい前。特徴あのジャパンに到来するスタイル。そうそう。最初は白いなんてテンポ。そう、この銭
あともともと温泉が多いです日本はあそういう入浴文化に対してみんな非常に昔から好きだったから東京 used to have about 2000 cento more than 2000 cento and over the last 15 years or so The number has been declining. Now there's about 600 remaining in Tokyo. People have baths in their houses. They're also much busier, have busier schedules. Sento's bathers have changed a lot over the years. With fewer bathers these days, Sento's have made more space between the showers. How long does Machida san stay in the bath? So, how is the price of the Sento decided? So, a simple bowl of soba noodles decided the price. When bowls got more expensive, so did the entrance fee. In Tokyo, it's now 460 yen. Takarayu's garden is also a big draw. You can watch the carp swim by. The building is also an attraction. Constructed in the 1930s, the outside maintains pretty much as it was back then. The bath is family run, and the owner showed me some of the history of the bath. みんな宮大工さん、大工さんがいた。みんな何十人か並んで記念撮影した。機械全然使ってないよね。そうですね。あの木造の、え、あの機械クレーンとかないです。人間パワー、人間パワー。お風呂の水を取り上げる井戸、
Let's meet the electric bath. Shocking. Shimokita Zawasan invites me to try it out. Everything looks fine. Another relaxing bath. Until things go totally wrong. Pulsing in the water is an electrical current. It's like he planned the whole thing. After a few minutes, he convinces me that it's good for my health and to give it another go. Of course, I'm skeptical about the whole thing, but maybe I didn't give it a fair chance. Yup, it's still shocking. And still rather funny to my friend. The current runs between these two bars. So now you know. Hisamatsuyu also has an outdoor hot spring bath that bubbles. So I think you really need to have this open air when you are in a real onsen because that, the cold air and the hot water really penetrates your soul, like it gives you energy, doesn't it? Good for your health. Yeah, <laughs> very good for your health. Every day, every day. Every, every day. day. Besides good health, what's the attraction for him? Hisamatsuyu was also an incredible Sento experience, and I'm starting to see why bath tourism is popular with Japanese. Each one is like entering a new world. Shimokita Zawasan knows about my final destination, Daikokuyu. But while I'm traveling there, let's take a look at some other sento in Tokyo. As I said before, the industry is changing to meet the times. This is the newly remodeled Sakayu. The new style is modern, giving bathers a totally different experience. Beautiful white walls in the changing room. You can see lighting is important to set the mood here. It looks like a scene from the future, a bath from the year 2050. And the sauna has incredible art on the ceiling. Bathing has gotten a lot more exciting at Sakayu. Another style shift is to go back in history to another era. Hasanuma Onsen is newly remodeled as well but in the 1920s Taisho era look. The Mount Fuji mural, usually over the bath, is now in the lobby so people can take photos of it. The ceiling is high, surrounded by stained glass and antique looking lights. The bath has painted tile, making it seem like a theme park. The main bath pays homage to Japan's oldest bathhouse, Dogo Onsen in Matsuyama, where I was in a previous episode. This is a hot spring, water with natural minerals coming from deep underground. Japan's four seasons painted above the showers. Going back in time is just as fun as going to the future. But there is one modern touch here, the carp swimming under the floor. It's digital. Welcome to Daikokuyu and Oshiage near the Tokyo Sky Tree. Come on in. It's an inviting place for locals and tourists alike. Leave your shoes in the locker and get a ticket from the vending machine. Like everywhere else, it's 460 yen. Bring your own towel or pay a little extra to rent one. You'll also get a key for your locker. The setup is a little similar to Takarayu. There's my good friend Fujisan on the wall above. Grab a bucket and a stool, rinse yourself off, then pick a bath. Super jet. Body massage. The sitting bath. The waterfall. The medicinal bath. The walking bath. This one, Daikokuyu, has wow, many different varieties, including an onsen. 
Daikokuyu pumps up water from the ground to bring an onsen experience to the bathers, something unique that's not in people's homes. You can also go upstairs to a lounge to cool off and relax. At 643 meters high, the Tokyo Sky Tree looks over the neighborhood. There's also a sauna here. But my favorite place in this sento is the retro hair dryer. No instruction manual needed. Plunk your head under the hood. Pay 20 yen or 15 cents. and enjoy a three-minute blow. Feels like you're inside an airplane turbine. The feeling is better than a double espresso. People with body art will be happy to know that Tokyo Sento are increasingly becoming tattoo friendly. The Sento is open to all and it's just 460 yen you can take your first step to be a Sento master. It's not just a bath, it's a relaxing experience that's good for your health, part of the culture and history, and one of those experiences that is certainly only in Japan. Enjoy your soak. If you liked it, hit that subscribe button and check out another one of our shows. Don't miss my second live streaming channel, Only in Japan Go! And check out location photos on Instagram. Mata ne!